Just give us a bit of background to the company first of all. Okay, the company has actually started in 1830 and has always been involved in scientific instruments and now we're specialising in solar radiation measurement. One of the things to draw people to your stand is uh, on, on display a sort of world's first in terms of equipment. Tell us about that. Uh, that's right. We've actually got here the world's first, shall we say, smart pyranometer, which is an instrument for measuring solar radiation. And this one has an integrated uh, microprocessor. And so it's, uh, it can do all sorts of clever data processing and you can interface it directly into modern data acquisition systems. And was that developed in response to what you were noticing customers need, like you said, the changing, changing customer base in some of it? Yes, this was a specific requirement from the solar power in industry, where people don't have traditional types of measurement techniques, they, they want a sort of computer-based system. Tell us about some of the people that you work with uh, and the sort of industries that demand your equipment. Yeah, our traditional customers are in meteorology and climatology, so that's weather networks around the world, people doing research into climate change. But uh, more recently, the last few years, it's been in solar energy, people who are really interested in actually making use of the power of the sun for greener energy. And how does that incorporate your equipment so they can monitor where the, the sun's at its strongest, where they can get the most power? That's right. First thing you have to find out where you can get the most benefit, where to site these big solar energy plants, and then you also have to monitor the efficiency, are they working properly, and developing new technologies. And why was it important that you came to the meteorological expert? Because we saw this as a, an opportunity in, in Europe to reach uh, perhaps a, a newer range, wider range of customers than the, the traditional exhibitions that we normally go to. And how has it been for you? It's been excellent. Actually, yesterday was uh, fantastic. One of the first days, best day, first days at an exhibition we've had, I think. And today has also been good. And what sort of people have you been speaking to and meeting here? They've been uh, a lot of people who are either system integrators, they are interested in buying our equipment to put into bigger systems, uh, a lot of people interested in solar energy, and also people in universities uh, and meteorology agencies interested in upgrading their networks and having better quality measurements.